Hawaii CDL practice test. Question 1. Is it true that as long as the engine is not overheated, it is completely safe to remove the radiator cap? Yes, as long as the radiator isn't damaged. Yes. No. Yes, as long as there is no overflow. Answer. No. Question 2. Why should you cover cargo? To protect your cargo from bad weather. Because many states require it. To protect individuals from any spilled cargo. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 3. The most important hand signal you should agree on with a helper is. Turn up the music. Go. Faster. Stop. Answer. Stop. Question 4. Which of the following is the key steering component? Bearing plate. Torque rod. Leaf spring. Gearbox. Answer. Gearbox. Question 5. What can you do at an accident site to help avoid another accident? Have a drink to calm your nerves. Put out warning devices so people don't run into the accident site. Leave your vehicle, do nothing, and get to higher ground. Stay in your vehicle and do nothing until help arrives. Answer Put out warning devices so people don't run into the accident site. Question 6 If you are traveling at 55 miles per hour in a 30 foot vehicle, you should leave how many seconds of following distance? 7 seconds. 4 seconds. 6 seconds. 3 seconds. Answer. 4 seconds. Question 7. Do empty trucks have the best braking? Yes. Yes, but only if the truck is newer than 1998. No. Yes, but only on wet surfaces. Answer. No. Question 8. What happens when you let the air out of hot tires? This is a good idea so the extra pressure is relieved. It will cool them down. You will be able to continue your journey sooner. This is a bad idea because when the tires cool off, the pressure will be too low. It has no effect at all. Answer This is a bad idea because when the tires cool off, the pressure will be too low. Question 9 you don't want to be a distracted driver, so you Only read maps or your phone when there are no cars around you. If possible, turn off your cell phone until you reach your destination. Have all your emotionally hard conversations in the first hour of driving. Smoke, eat, and drink during straight portions of the road. Answer. If possible, turn off your cell phone until you reach your destination. Question 10. How often must you stop to check your cargo while on the road? 
every 3 hours or 150 miles. After each break you take while you're driving. Within the first 15 miles. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 11. How many tie downs are required for a 20 foot load? 3 tie downs. 2 tie downs. 1 tie down. 4 tie downs. Answer. 2 tie downs. Question 12. An anti lock braking system will let you drive faster. Keep your brakes from locking up when you brake hard. Shorten your stopping distance. Increase a vehicle's ultimate stopping power. Answer Keep your brakes from locking up when you brake hard. Question 13. Before transporting a sealed load, you must check that you don't exceed gross weight and axle weight limits. A small sample of whatever is inside. A picture of whatever is inside. All of the above. Answer. That you don't exceed gross weight and axle weight limits. Question 14. Why is it important to use a helper when backing? Because you are providing a job for someone else. Because people feel more comfortable when you do. Because you have blind spots. All of the above. Answer. Because you have blind spots. Question 15. While driving at night, which beams should you use as often as you can? High beams. Novelty lights. Emergency flashers. Low beams. Answer. High beams. Question 16. On wet roads, you should reduce your speed by one third, one quarter, one half. 60%. Answer. One third. Question 17. During your pre trip test, when examining hoses with the instructor, you need to look for low windshield washer fluid level, phrase in the water pump belt, puddles on the ground. The location of the dipstick. Answer. Puddles on the ground. Question 18. Which of the following can you not use a BC fire extinguisher on? Grease fire. Electrical fire. Wood. Gasoline fire. Answer. Wood. Question 19. What is not one of the four skill areas that operating a commercial vehicle requires? First aid certification. Accelerating. Safely backing. Steering. Answer. First aid certification. Question 20. Which of the following should you do when confronted by an aggressive driver? Ignore rude gestures and refuse to react negatively. 
avoid eye contact. If you can safely do it, call the police from a cell phone. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 21. How many hours of sleep does the average person need per night, or risk accumulating sleep debt? 6 to 8 hours. 7 to 8 hours. 8 to 9 hours. 6 to 7 hours. Answer. 7 to 8 hours. Question 22. Which of the following is not something you should check during a trip? Tires. Cargo and cargo covers. Mirrors. Text messages. Answer. Text messages. Question 23. What is the best way to figure out how many seconds of following distance you have? Use the stopwatch on your phone to try to determine how long before you reach a mile marker after the car in front of you appeared to reach it. Text a friend and tell them to text you back in 10 seconds and see how long that seemed to take compared to far you traveled. Wait until a vehicle passes a shadow or landmark, and count the seconds until you pass it. Get one-fourth closer to the car in front of you, then back off again. Multiply how long this took you by four for following distance. Answer Wait until a vehicle passes a shadow or landmark, and count the seconds until you pass it. Question 24. Which of these is not part of the basic method for shifting up? Release the clutch and press the accelerator at the same time. Push in the clutch and shift into higher gear at the same time. Accelerate while pressing the clutch and turning toward the driver's side. Release the clutch. Answer. Accelerate while pressing the clutch and turning toward the driver's side. Question 25. Which of the following should you not do if you experience a tire failure? Be aware that a tire has failed. Stay off the brake pedal. Engage the brakes hard and immediately. Hold the steering wheel firmly. Answer. Engage the brakes hard and immediately. Question 26. What might happen if you swing wide to the left before you turn right? You might damage your leaf springs. Someone might try to pass you on your left. Someone might try to pass you on your right. All of the above. Answer. Someone might try to pass you on your right. Question 27. What is a common cause of tire fires? Underinflated tires. Cold tires. Overinflated tires. All of the above. Answer. Underinflated tires. Question 28. To help you stay alert and safe while driving, you should Avoid medications with warning labels. Roll down your windows to get fresh air. Drink coffee if you get drowsy. Have a whiskey to brace yourself. Answer. Avoid medications with warning labels. 
Question 29. Total stopping distance is a combination of Reaction distance plus viewing distance plus breaking distance Reaction distance plus breaking distance Breaking distance plus stopping distance Perception distance plus reaction distance plus breaking distance Answer Perception distance plus reaction distance plus breaking distance Question 30. How many seconds does it take for a normal tractor trailer to clear a double track? 10 seconds More than 30 seconds More than 15 seconds 14 seconds Answer More than 15 seconds Question 31. If you double your speed, how much more distance will it take to stop? Four times as much. Three times as much. Five times as much. Twice as much. Answer. Four times as much. Question 32. You should inspect wheel bearing seals for Leaking Tears Broken leaf springs Twisted axles Answer Leaking Question 33. How long will you lose your CDL driving privileges if you are convicted of a second DUI offense in either a CMV or your private vehicle? Life. Five years minimum. One year minimum. Ten years minimum. Answer. Life. Question 34. You should place the starter switch key into your pocket while you are performing the pre-trip inspection because Someone could start and move the truck. Someone could steal the truck. It could damage the starting mechanism. All of the above. Answer. Someone could start and move the truck. Question 35. The minimum tire tread depth for front tires is four thirty seconds inch depth, three eighths inch depth, one thirty second inch depth, one half inch depth. Answer four thirty seconds inch depth. Question 36. Which of the following determines the safe speed for going down a steep downgrade? The steepness of the grade. The total weight of the vehicle and cargo. The road conditions. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 37. Where should you place your warning devices, if you must stop on a one-way or a divided highway? 10 feet, 100 feet, and 200 feet toward approaching traffic. 50 feet, 100 feet, and 150 feet toward approaching traffic. 20 feet, 50 feet, and 100 feet toward approaching traffic. 100 feet, 200 feet, and 300 feet toward approaching traffic. Answer 10 feet, 100 feet, and 200 feet toward approaching traffic. Question 38. Which of these are you not responsible for it when it comes to your cargo? 
Recognizing possible overloads. Making sure that cargo is properly secured. Ensuring the freshness of sealed cargo. Inspecting the cargo. Answer. Ensuring the freshness of sealed cargo. Question 39. What constitutes a hazardous materials placard? Signs on the inside of the vehicle that remind the driver what he is carrying. Signs on the outside of the vehicle that identify the hazard class of cargo. Signs that help tax collectors determine how much to tax a hazardous cargo. Signs that warn the public to stay at least 1,000 feet away from the vehicle. Answer. Signs on the outside of the vehicle that identify the hazard class of cargo. Question 40. What is the minimum age to receive a CDL in the state of Hawaii? 17. 25. 18. 21. Answer. 21. Question 41. Retarders keep you from skidding on the road because They help you control your speed. They give you more control over your brakes. They don't, you skid more easily with retarders. They help reduce your reaction distance. Answer. They don't, you skid more easily with retarders. Question 42. Which two special conditions indicate that you should downshift? Starting up a hill and finishing a curve. Starting up a hill and entering a curve. Starting down a hill and entering a curve. Starting down a hill and finishing a curve. Answer. Starting down a hill and entering a curve. Question 43. What is the gross vehicle weight, GVW? A vehicle's maximum weight rating, specific by its manufacturer. The total weight of a single vehicle and its load. The total weight that includes the vehicle, towed vehicles, and the load. All of the above. Answer. The total weight of a single vehicle and its load. Question 44. How can you determine if your vehicle is equipped with ABS? Look for wheel speed sensor wires that are coming from the rear of your brakes. Check if your vehicle was manufactured after March 1, 1998, they are required to have the panel light. Check for yellow ABS malfunction lamps on the instrument panel. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 45. What's the definition of a hazard? Something you must stop for. A road user or road condition that could be a possible danger. Something you can safely ignore. Something you can easily avoid. Answer. A road user or road condition that could be a possible danger. Question 46. What will help a drunk sober up? Time. Fresh air. Coffee. A glass of water. Answer. Time. 
Question 47. Starting the engine and inspecting the cab involves each of these tasks, except Checking the air pressure gauge Starting the engine, then listening for unusual noises Starting the engine, then putting the gear shift in neutral Checking the transmission controls Answer Starting the engine then putting the gear shift in neutral. Question 48. It has just reached freezing. Which of the following areas is slippery? A bridge. When looking road. A shaded area. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 49. Always try to back toward the driver's side because You can see better, watching the vehicle rear out the side window. It's more comfortable for turning your neck. Your truck will naturally pull toward the driver's side. All of the above. Answer You can see better. Watching the vehicle rear out the side window. Question 50. How can you start moving without rolling backward? Put on the parking brake whenever necessary. Engage the clutch before removing your foot from the brake. Apply the hand valve. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Thank you for watching the video and wish you will get your driver license soon.